just better off to just take the damage at higher levels of play mm -hmm. and just move on back to neutral. Right. You can't avoid getting hit all the time. You've got to be able to know what hits you can take and can't take. Absolutely. All right. And we have RTN Neos versus P2W Iron Wolf up next on stream. I believe this is winner's semis mm -hmm. of Wave 3. Uh, this will be interesting. Uh, we have Neos, the resident Rosalina man. Um, oh, yeah. Always very consistent. Does really well. I know you play with him a lot. Um, oh, yeah. My best <laughs> bud for yeah. 16 years now. <laughs> <Yeah>. So I... <laughs> I know a little bit about Neos. I don't. Um, I'm familiar with Iron Wolf, but I don't think I've ever personally seen him play live. So this will be interesting to see. I um, have Iron Wolf. Uh, I'd say it's been on a little bit of a hiatus as of recent. Mm -hmm. um, P2W used to host the Let's Garden series in Georgia, which was an amazing tournament series. It is. Um, but uh, after that, I believe most of P2W kind of just took a chill pill, uh, stayed away from Smash Team for a little bit, but mm -hmm. he's back here, here to play. And obviously, doing a great job as he's still in Winter Semis of Pools. So hopefully he has something to show us. Now this matchup, not fun for Rosen. <laughs> I mean, I, I was gonna say yeah. Time and time again, I've seen this matchup being played out. I've tried to help Neos out with it. I've seen the Buzz play this matchup. It's, it's, it's just not fun for no. Rosa no, in many Cla aspects. And I think one of the main factors is Cloud has some really good tools to deal with uh, Luma. Oh um, yeah, absolutely. And that that's pretty much. 80% of the Rosalina matchup is can you get rid of Luma? Can you deal with Luma and mitigate what Luma can do? Oh, because yeah. Rosalina by herself is a pretty decent character, but nowhere near as good as she is with Luma. Oh, yeah. So one thing I want to point out is just go through the list. I do this every time I fight Rosa. Just go through the list of moves for a certain character that immediately puts Luma in knockback. Right. Uh, Cloud's dash attack, one of them that actually just kills Luma outright. Yep. Cross slash, another move. Uh, sweet spot down here, I'd say, actually does knock out Luma, but it's something you generally won't see. Right. Uh, back here, not so much. Down tilt actually knocks out Luma immediately. Yep. Oh. Uh, and that's a lot of moves, and a lot of those moves are pretty safe, and he can throw out there. Again, looking for a dash attack right there, trying to deal with the Luma. But get, oh, yeah, my gosh. That's air dodge. That's yeah. the one spot you don't want to air dodge. What we were talking about earlier, just eat the up air and jump out. Just get right. out of there. But air dodging there, and Neos is able to get the kill really early. So let's we'll see if he can convert this stock. Only 50%. Oh, yeah. Iron oh. Wolf came in really strong at the beginning, was dealing with Luma well and got some damage, but Neos adapting really quickly, putting a lot of percentage on and getting the kill off the top. Oh, yeah. One thing I do want to note is that Iron Wolf's back air game is, is solid. And, yeah. you know, generally Cloud does want a back air, but I feel like favoring... Is that death? No, 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 not yet. I feel like favoring dash attack and cross slash in this matchup is actually good because, again, you're trying to think of it in a situation of just cut your losses. Yeah. If you kill Luma with his dash attack, oh, that's death. That's absolutely okay. Oh, limit. we got the limit. Okay. Oh, look oh, at the spike on the spike. tanner. Yeah, barely missing it. But Neo's laughing him in percent uh, oh, yeah. controlling this match right now. This is looking rough. Yeah, but there goes Luma. Let's see if he, uh, PTW Armwolf can capitalize on this. Almost getting that down yeah. here again, but it's going to stuff him out. Um, Neo's doing a really good job of capitalizing on the mistakes that uh, Iron Wolf is making. Oh, yeah, that's death. Yeah. Yeah, he's done. Uh, but as I was saying earlier, I feel as if the backer spacing game is okay, but it's a lot easier to play that game once Luma's gone. Right. So I feel as if it's a lot better to just dash attack or cross slash Luma. Um, and even if Rosalina is next to you in shielding, as long as you're not at kill percents from up smash or four right. smash or anything like that, it's okay because the most she's going to do is just grab you and maybe get an up tilt. Yeah. But if she puts you in the air above her, she doesn't have Luma, you're a cloud, you can right. challenge her. Um, so I feel like it's really worth just dash attacking and cross slashing, even if you know you're not going to get the percent on Rosalina, just to get rid of the star, right. just so that you can play your game. Again, it's the calculated risk where you'll take a little bit of damage, but you're not going to get a huge payoff. Absolutely. Or, uh, not, I'm sorry, a huge punish. But uh, Wilat Counterpick, trying to get some jank on Rosalina's recovery. Um, Rosalina has been somewhat notorious on the stage for <laughs> going under it. Oh, yeah. Um, but right now, it's not even near the corner. No. Neo's not giving him that opportunity to even see the ledge. Nope. Neo's doing a really good job just keeping uh, Iron Wolf out. He's got limit, but he's on the edge of the stage. If Neos can make him burn it, does not. Iron Wolf is able to recover and get rid of Luma at the same time. Oh, yeah. Now, I do want to say, oh, that should That's be it. a burn limit. Yeah, it's going to yep. burn it right there. It's going to get back to the stage safely. I do want to say that this stage is actually really good for Cloud, and in my opinion, yeah. probably his best neutral stage. Uh, just because Cloud with a lead can actually just platform camp really effectively, and a lot of characters can't really deal with it. Yeah. Um, now, granted, the ledges are there, and they do give him a little bit of trouble. 
yeah, that's going to be dead. Yep. But overall, I feel like the amount of neutral control that he gets in this match is well worth it. Yeah, I agree. Um, like you said, I think it's Cloud's best stage as well. I think this, and I think Battlefield's another stage of Dreamland where you can platform camp. Cloud just thrives with platforms, in my opinion, and I'll, the smaller ones really help him because of this coverage with his down and stuff oh, like yeah. that. And just a little, you know, gimmick that you can throw out. Neutral B actually curves on the side, so it makes it pretty pretty consistent as far as two-framing certain characters as long as your timing is okay. Mm -hmm. uh, since the blade beam just travels downwards. Oh, no, that's a dead cloud. That's yep. absolutely dead. And Neo's taking that really convincingly. Love yeah. tap. Yeah. <laughs> just, just making sure. 